So it's, it's filming now. How the hell are you? I'm here with my cousin Nikki. Nikki I haven't seen in like 10 years. We're on the same page, right? About a decade since we've chilled. About a decade. We've seen each other at like social events, family obligations, but we haven't yeah. chilled. About a decade. I hit Nikki up because he's a video guy. I gotta make this video. I say to Nikki, Nikki, I need the audio. Do we have a microphone? Nikki goes, yes or no. I'm not gonna say you said yes, but Nikki says, I can get a microphone, not a huge deal. We're good. I say, let me know if you can't, just in case. Nikki says to me, uh, okay, whatever, we're good. A few days later, now here we are. It's the day we're supposed to shoot the video. Nikki texts me about four hours before we're supposed to meet up. Couldn't get a microphone. Could you? I'm like, could I? You didn't. You didn't say anything. Did you or did you not? Did we? Did I say I will let you? You'll let me. Uh, you, let me know if you couldn't find a microphone. I mean, you know. That's I, what happened. I say a lot of things. All right, whatever. I just felt like I'm paying you though, right? I'm gonna pay you some money. And it was like, on my wedding day, I'm the bride and the wedding DJ is like, hey, I couldn't find any speakers. Do you have speakers? Like, no, I don't have any speakers. And why are you bothering me today? It's my wedding day, but whatever. I go to Best Buy, ask them for a microphone thinking it's not a huge deal. I'll pick up a microphone real quick. They look at me like I have six heads. Microphones are seasonal. Microphones are seasonal. Nobody ever needs a fucking microphone. Microphones are seasonal for Christmas because people need them for karaoke machines. I go to Toys R Us next door. My man Raul in there happened to run a production company so he's like, oh, I know microphones. You should get a SM800 at uh, Castellano's House of Music. I don't have time for any of that, Raul. This is the one I got. It was $17. It's pink. Let's move past it. It's a pink microphone. This is what we're working with. So we were going to do Pokemon Go. Where are they now? We're still going to try and do that. Um, where are they now, Pokemon Go? Because obviously it took over the world like two months ago. Pokemon Go this, Pokemon Go that. You don't really hear about it anymore. Kind of fell off the face of the earth. Nobody talks about it. So um, I wanted to come down and see who's still playing Pokemon Go. Apparently no one is. This was at one point the hottest Pokemon Go stop on the borough of Staten Island. And I came here once and there were like 50 people here playing Pokemon Go. And now I'm here and no one's playing Pokemon Go. So uh, we're going to talk about maybe some other stuff. But uh, we're here and we're going to see what happens. I'm not satisfied with okay. this, okay? Right. Yeah, she's probably trying to wait out. Right, no problem. Excuse me. I'm trying to make a video. Is there any way you have a minute to talk to me? Oh, no. I was right. like... So many people don't want to talk to me. It's actually hilarious. Like you would think I have leprosy or something. The first gentleman that's going to allow me to uh, interview him. Did you go to Princeton? No. You didn't go to Princeton? No. Why do you have the t-shirt? Uh, someone gave it to me. That's, I, think I, I like, like it though. Yeah. It's it's a nice orange. Do you play Pokemon Go at all? I came down here because this was like the biggest Pokemon Go stop on the island at one point, and I expected there to be like 100 people here playing, and no one's playing. So are you here doing that? I'm not here doing that, but I play Pokemon. Do you, Do you like it? You fuck with that game? Yeah, I do. Okay. Are you concerned at all about the fact that like no one's down here, literally at all, playing Pokemon Go? It's a university fan. There's a funny story about the mic. So you're fishing out here. Are you also playing Pokemon Go? Hell fucking no. <laughs> Hell no. Why not? For what? I mean, I I don't know. I mean, that game's a waste of time. A person has no life to play Pokemon Go all day. I mean, isn't in many ways fishing the Pokemon Go of the high seas? No, fishing is fishing. Fishing is for boys. I didn't expect to encounter New York's most cultured socialites because it's like Saturday evening right now. But at the same time, I came here once and there was a truck down there selling ice cream. If you've ever seen one of those, people running about, jolly teens on bicycles, everyone playing Pokemon Go. I, I just don't even know what to say right now. But we're going to find people. We're going to find people to talk to. Do you guys have a minute to talk to me for the video I'm making? Come on, we look like shit. Right? No, listen, there was a girl that looked like a hundred times the shit that you look like, and she was walking down, so and she awesome? said it. No, you look like awesome right now. Honestly, like, you're both very hot. Okay, so let's continue. All right, <laughs> so let me ask you a question. I came down here to make a video about Pokemon Go. I you know what? I'm a Jigglypuff. You're not a Jigglypuff. Girls aren't into Pokemon Go. We've established that. If a guy was, like, perfect but played Pokemon Go, would you go out with him? Absolutely not. What's the big deal? <laughs> I think, yeah, yeah, probably. I think so we got an absolutely not, and she's like on board with it. Another raging debate in the streets right now. Team cargo shorts or not, don't be biased by the fact that I'm standing in front of you wearing cargo shorts. If you see a guy in cargo shorts, are you like that's a turnoff, or are you like it doesn't even compute in your mind? It doesn't come like. It's fine. Yeah. That's why do people hate on? It's like a made up thing. No, it's a made up thing. My, he's looking at me like I'm like I'm stupid for even. He's not wearing cargo. See, all right. See, it's a I'm made up thing that people hate on cargo shorts. It's a made up thing that people hate on cargo shorts. Too. So I'm trying to go out there and raise awareness. I had a guy before. He told me they're so convenient. And for me, it's like a step up from basketball shorts. Like if I was out here in basketball shorts, it's like maybe that's like kind of like you know I'm schlepping don't around. But shorts. don't wear jean shorts if you're. A guy no, I would never wear jorts. That's like. If I see a guy approaching me in jean shorts, I'm turning around. No, jorts definitely suck. I would never do that to myself. This is kind of classy. Like I would go out like this to like most places. 
All right. Most? Why most? Why not all? <laughs> well, I wouldn't go to like, you know, the, like the 40-40 club like this, but like I'm telling you, like 99% of places, I would show up just like this. I don't think it's a bad thing. No. The truck has arrived. That's uh, that's huge news. So I think things are about to heat up over here. Ice cream truck. Let's do it. Vanilla bowl of sprinkles, please. This fucking guy just asked me what kind of sprinkles I want on my cone. Rainbow. <laughs> fucking rainbow. Rainbow sprinkles the only reason you get the cone. The only reason. I'm here with Bandana Guy. I'm Mike. I know you're Bandana Guy. What's your real name? What are you? Randy. Randy. Do you, your friends call you Bandana Guy? No. All right. Um, what are you doing in the ballpark here today? Because we're just here. We're trying to make a video about Pokemon Go. Are you just like chilling? Or? I'm just walking along, catching the air. Uh, so what happened was I was trying to make this video, seeing how people are receiving Pokemon Go. Everybody was down here at one point playing that shit. Nobody's down here anymore playing that shit. Do you play Pokemon Go? Have you ever played Pokemon Go? Mm -mm. No, I don't. No. At one point, it was like the hot thing to do in the streets. Like all the cool kids were under the boardwalks, you know, ripping cigs, playing Pokemon Go. Not so much anymore. Um, have you seen any cool kids around here playing Pokemon Go that I could talk to? Besides you, bandana guy. No, besides that one, they normally be over there. That's what I'm saying. That, By the ice cream truck. Yeah, they, they normally be there. I don't know what's going on. All right. That's why I'm walking down here to go see what they're doing now. You popped out to me right away, Frank. You seem like a like we got like a kindred spirit thing going on. How long have you lived on Staten Island, Frank? I lived in Staten Island for 46 years. You're Italian? Yes. Where are you from on the boot? Sicily. Half Sicily. Me too. I'm half Sicily, half Naples. Well, I'm from Sella Mario de Golf, Provincia Java. Nice. How, how long you been in America, Frank? 61 years. 61 years? Hey, I gotta tell you real quick, I was walking down, yeah. I said to him, I need an Italian guy. It was like God dropped you down here, Frank. Give me the cosa vuoi parlare di me. Che cosa che ti dico? Vuoi parlare con me balls? Parlare con me cosa dite? Che parlare con me? I don't speak Italian, but I totally agree. Young kids my age, we like to play a game. Will you play it with me really quickly? What kind of game you want me to play? Alright, I'm gonna ask you a question. I'm gonna give you three options, and I need you to categorize, categorize each option. Excuse my language. It's called marry, fuck, kill. Marry, fuck, kill. Yeah. But, but you put half in the, in the, in the, in the cook. That's not right. But that's not this is this is what we're yeah, gonna do. No, 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 no. This is what you want to say fuck in the, in the machine. It's not because then you gotta. Go. I could say no. We could say fuck. It's fine. So this is what I want to do. Marry, fuck, kill. Galma, brujut, and fresh mutts. You can have one all the time. You can have one a few times, and I one you can never Kalama. have again. I say Kalama. Kalama all the time. You're going to marry Kalama. Kalama, all because Kalama is made with spaghetti. I, you need it with the spaghetti. Okay, what are you going to, which one of those three food items? I just told you. No, Kalama. no, but which one, which one of the three do you want to fuck? Which one of the three are you going to Kalama. Gonna have? Kalama. Which one are you going to kill then? Are you going to get rid of the fresh mutts or the... Well, I don't like mozzarella. You don't like mozzarella? No, not much. Mozzarella is not good. They get fat. Calamari made nice skin. If it was up to me, I'm probably marrying fresh mutts. Well, you I'm gonna. I, I, well, I mean, I got the pounds on me already, so it's. Yeah. A, I, I'm gonna probably fuck Galama and then I'm gonna kill Brajut, even though I love Brajut. Well, I don't know what to tell you. This has been uh, Pokemon Go. Where are they now? <laughs>